After 52 years at Dorchester School District 2, Superintendent Joe Pye is in his last week. Hard Call, to believe. Yeah, calling it a career, yeah. right? As Octavia Mitchell reports, it's an end to an era, but begins a new chapter for one of the longest serving superintendents in the state. Morning. Teacher, principal, superintendent, in one role or another, right. Superintendent Joseph Pye right. has walked the halls of buildings in Dorchester School District 2 for more than 50 years. 23 years as the district's okay. top educator. So this last week I'm working as hard as I worked the first week when I started 23 years ago. A rush of memories and, and, and things, you know, that, that I think we've accomplished, but then there's a side of me that says, it was still not enough. You know, what else could we have done? And wish I'd done this, wish I'd done that. But then I have to stop and think. I'm glad I didn't do this. I'm glad I didn't do that. So it's, a, it's been a mixed bag. Now, after postponing retirement 10 years ago, why now? You know, when you've plowed the field as many times as I have, it's just I looked at my poor mule's track. And I'm going, I don't want anybody to tap me on the shoulder and say, it's past your time, you need to go. And I just sort of sensed. I'm never going to be ready, never, but I'm going to do it. Celebrations and surprises are taking place across the district to honor Mr. Pye's tenure. All down the hallway and at a parade at the Asher Ridge Marching Band going through the halls, all the kids were out in the halls clapping oh. and screaming over the signs. And Including here at Pye Elementary, named after the beloved superintendent. They had named the loop um, Pye Parkway. Pi ends his career in DD2, the same place it started as a teacher. His office suite is comprised of his former Rawlings classroom. All right, really, that was my class, uh -huh. and that was my class. This was another class in between. Uh -huh. Education runs deep in the Pi family. His wife is a retired educator, and his son is a principal at Rawlings. I've had a great learning experience my whole career. I'm the average kid, maybe below average, that, that people would not have expected success from. After so many years in education, his biggest accomplishment... Never losing sight that I was a blessed person to have this job, any job in education, and it was my love of children. And don't forget it's about the children. What would you say was your biggest challenge? Mm. My biggest challenge it's always been funding. The district's just never had the right funding. And the pandemic probably was the next big hurdle for me. Superintendent Pye says the hardest part is leaving his district and school staff, principals, teachers, and students. And I'm going to miss the kids. But you know what? I love my job. You know, there are bad moments. But I honestly say that's why I've stayed so long. I truly have loved this job because I have. Um, 26,000 students, and I have 3,800 employees. I'm the biggest employer in Dorchester County. So I think I've done well as a CEO, but I give all the glory to God. At 74, Mr. Pye will start a new life's lesson. He says he's confident he's leaving the top school district in nurturing hands. What would you like your legacy to be? He gave it his all. This has been my life, my whole life. Octavia Mitchell, Count On Two.